Welcome back to our channel, the channel for the latest news and untold stories about Catherine, the Princess of Wales and her royal family. You guys might know it's no secret that there are a number of rules that the royal family must follow, from permission for marriage proposals to keeping PDA to a minimum, and no signatures for royal fans. It has been revealed that the future king and queen have a lot of unique rules for their beloved children, as well as for all their members of staff at their family home, and the rules won't be what you're expecting. However, William and Catherine like to keep things casual when they're at home with their three children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. According to royal journalist Valentine Lowe, revealed that the Prince and Princess of Wales try to cultivate an informal setting at their residence. To achieve this, the couple has reportedly asked royal staffers not to wear formal attire to their home unless there is an extenuating circumstance. As one anonymous staffer told Lowe in an interview, Prince William wants it to be casual. The kids run around the office, and he does not want it to be stuffy. If we have important meetings or are going to Buckingham Palace, then, of course, we dress up. It's not the only way that the royal couple has diverted from traditions. They have also rejected traditional parenting methods in favor of a more modern approach to caring for their three children. The hands-on parents want their children to learn to talk about their feelings rather than lose their temper. Because of this, nobody in the royal household, staff included, is allowed to shout at them. An anonymous insider told that shouting is absolutely off-limits in their home. Qualified early years practitioner and parenting consultant Kirsty Kettle recently spoke about Catherine's approach to raising her children and explained why she believes it's an approach for parents to follow. Her analysis revealed that the Princess of Wales is fast becoming an icon in the parenting and early years world, and it isn't because of her nannies. In the Princess case, she has a tight-knit family and her childhood home was full of love. According to the parenting expert, the Wales approach to parenting includes several factors, such as the sofa chat. The princess has previously revealed that there is no shouting and yelling in their house and that they choose time in when things escalate with a sofa chat. The sofa chat and time in means sitting with your child rather than putting them into solitary confinement and talking through their behavior once they are calmer. It helps children to regulate their emotions better and helps keep their self-esteem intact. They are also more likely to come to you for help when the bigger things happen rather than try and hide them from you for fear of punishment. Another unusual rule of the Prince and Princess of Wales for their kids that their three children often have to sit separately from their parents at dinner time, revealed a longtime royal chef, Darren McGrady. He explained that the youngsters aren't allowed to sit with the adults until they have learned the art of polite conversation. There were never any exceptions, including for large holidays such as Christmas. The children always ate in the nursery until they were old enough to conduct themselves properly at the dining table. He also said the children's nannies were given the task to educate their palates too. Nanny always had control of the menu and made sure they ate balanced meals that included not only lots of healthy vegetables but introduced them to new grown-up dishes too.